So Eric, what's my shipment? Jordan was supposed to pick it up last night. He didn't? Answer your own question, please. He didn't. You know you just lost me a ton of money, Eric, right? I paid you to do a job and I expect it done. And your crew can't be trusted. You can't be trusted. What would you do if you were in my position, hmm? I might have more money for you. No, answer the fucking question. What would you do to someone that just lost you a ton of money? I'd kill him. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Guys? <clears throat> so why shouldn't I kill you? Because I have money coming in. Pulled a job a couple days ago. Could have a big payoff. So you pull the job behind my back? Yes. But I knew it'd make you a lot of money. The fuck you did? What job? I snatched a kid. You kidnapped a kid? Yeah, that guy's Eric kidnapped a kid. <laughs> So where's the kid? I had him with me. Luke and Jordan took him. Mm -hmm. uh, don't worry. I don't followed. Where the fuck is the money? I'm positive the father gave us a shitload, but Luke won't tell me. So I had Jordan's sister picked up. You know, if you let me go, I can find out. There better be money. There better be a lot of it. And I gotta have it by tomorrow. I get the fuck out of my sight. I'm running, you're chasing, and now I'm over, over but you. Whoa. Eric's dead. They're all dead. They got everybody. So you interrupt my spaghetti dinner for this shit? This is very fucking upsetting. I want. That kid found, I want Luke found, kill them. I don't want to hear anything about them ever again. You hear me? Yes. Matter of fact, why are you the only one alive from his crew if they're all dead? I ran away. What, I have a crew of pussies now? Are you going to run? I'm scared. Well, it looks like you're in charge now. You can go. What's good, Evans? Yeah, what's going on, man? Son, I don't know you was doing stuff like that, son. <laughs> Come on, man. I mean, yeah, man. I mean, I'm going to be honest. Like, you know, I get all the shorties because you pass me the ball. <laughs> this is type crazy, right, though, right? All right, all right. Yeah, what's up? Yo, but look, though, man, I was feeling you, you know? So look, here's the situation. Uh -huh. I got the crib. Okay. My girl, she bringing her friend. OK. So what up? You trying to come through tomorrow or what? Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. How's uh -huh. her girl, her friend look, man? All right, look, I'm going to just say this. There's a scale from 1 to 10. She's an 11. Really? That means she's what? She's bad, bro. She's tough. Forget bad, she's tough. <laughs> All right. So look, I'm so, there. So, so here's the thing, right? All right, All right look, I'm going to leave school around like 12 to 12.30. All right. You come to the crib like 1. All you know, right. I mean, you know I stayed around the corner from the school, so it was nothing. Okay. You know what I mean? So, you know, you just hit me up tonight, and I'll let you know. And guess what? And we're going to have drinks. So, right, so, you might, so you might get lucky, uh, you know, probably once or maybe even twice. twice. Hey, I mean, I got the licks. Only thing you got to do is come through, talk to Shorty, make it do what it do, and it is what it is, right? All right, cool. So I'm there tomorrow then. So tomorrow, man. All right. I'll let me know. Yes, sir. Yo, won't you be safe going home? It's crazy over here. Yo, what's good, eh? What's going on, man? Yo, she in here looking good, son. I'm telling you, son. Really? I'm not even going to tell you. Come on. Come on. Yeah. 
Evans. Here's my girlfriend, Tanya. What's up? And this is her friend, Jocelyn. How you doing? This is Evans. Yeah, what's that? 